Hello guys, welcome to episode 16 of Let's Play Fallout Tactic with me, Haxi Rage. Last episode, some shit happened. Um, we fought a bunch of geezers on this uh, roof here, and on this roof here. It was done in a long-winded way that I can only apologise for if it is boring. If you find it entertaining, then awesome. Keep watching and there will probably be some more long-winded fights like that. Now! This episode may be slightly different on the account of oh, I'd have a little bit to drink tonight and I've decided to do this episode. <coughs> Sorry it's been a little bit a uh, little bit of a while, uh, but I have been distracted with other games and such. Um, okay, so now let's have a look at the map quickly. So we are here roughly. We need to go blomp, 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 blomp. We can check this out if we've got time and or in, are in a good position, i.e. not dying. So, let's uh, let's have a look at uh, what can be done next. Shall we get our guys in this car and have a little bit of a drive? My instinct says yes. Now, who's our pilot for the day? The highest pilot skill, it's Stein. Stein, you're being judged as this is your first mission. I believe. It's been a little while. Over a month, I think. Now, uh, let's have a close look at the map and zoom out on that so we can see more. Oh, dude on the roof, but I think we can get by him. I mean, if it's up to me, I wouldn't get by him. I'd store every bandit that I came across. Oh, look at this dude! Oh, you think you can get away, do you? Well, Mr. Glass Cannon Jax thinks otherwise. Come, Jax! Much slaughtering must be done. So, are you friendly? Hand what over? Is the, the chest you just told me about? Oh, I'm killing him anyway. Pfft. Yeah, hand it over. Bitch! Take it all your stuff! And that's how Jax does things, ladies and gentlemen. He just, he doesn't ask questions. You talk to him, you die. That's how things work. Because he is our... No, no, no. No, Stein. Stein. Stop it. Okay, do a circle. Yeah. Stein, do a quiet. There's a glass coming. Here he is. Right. So. From my understanding, we need to uh, press a switch. It's going to open this gate. And then each gate there's going to be a corresponding switch. Which... Aha! There it is. Just lucky, I didn't really want to go in this building. I thought it was going to be in there. Um, let's have a look ahead of us, so we can pre-plan our little journey. Uh, switch, up here. Damn, we have to go in this building. Across here. We can probably go down this little alleyway here if we want to. Or maybe this one, rather. Um, main road, main road, main road. Another gate, switch, and exit. This is our route, um, which I've not really remembered very well. So, Mr. Glass Cannon, would you be so kind as to open this door? Let's hope it's not booby trapped, as he's a glass cannon. Okay, that's not as bad as booby trapped, that's just locked. Which, far sight, is pretty decent in unlocking. Especially if I have tools here. Hmm, so someone has a key, is that right? Aha! Brian. Open this damn door. There we go. In fact, now pretty much everyone's out of the car already. Let's just, uh. Let's just have a look, shall we? Who else is about? Stitch. You're not out of the car. Mind you, you have a shotty. So you might as well drive for now. Cool. So, we've got our five dudes all like having a bit of a chill. Getting ready to open this gate. Understand. How can you block a door in such a way? Now, oh. oh, that's my question. Physics. So there opens the door. Now, expecting some sort of resistance, I'm going to be sneaking. Who's going to sneak? Oh, we've detected. Who are you? Stein, the new recruit. Who did I not want to? Uh, 
Ooh, red dots. Can he just like boss it? Can he boss up the other side? Facts. We want to take this. Oh. Well, it's a good thing I didn't mind that Brian died because he just got blown up with a rocket launcher. Hmm. Now, because the combat ended, all their APs back, which is a little bit annoying. <sighs> oh, Brian. Brian. I want you back so bad, but you're gone. Cool, so what we need to do now is. Just move these. I don't know. Okay then, fine. Close the gate for whatever reason. I need you guys to move a little bit here. I need you to drive a little bit closer. What we're gonna do. This guy's a rocket launcher. I don't know what the other dude had, but. Rocket launcher is enough. We're going to drive him in. He's got 185 health points. I don't think a rocket launcher can do that much damage. So, he's going to take the brunt of the attacks. So we're going to run these guys in and we're going to mop them up. Hopefully. Actually, got a better idea. Get them all in there, drive it up to them, and then do that. Crazy, I know. As I said, I've had a drink. It could all go wrong. Hacks could die. This could be the end of this let's play as we know it. Sweet, sweet cider. Right. Where was I? Who's driving now? It's still you, Stein. No, nope. it's Farsight. Cool, cool, cool. Let's do it. Drive towards the guy with the rocket launcher. That makes so much sense. Yeah. Oh. This dude. Done something explosive to me. Grenade launcher, perhaps? It wasn't a rocket, because that, that animation alone is a pretty big deal. Oh, I'm liking your hit chance. Let's cap some fools. And he hit both of them. Oh no. He may have hit him, but anyway. 90%, do you know what? It's not such a bad idea to do that. That's what you get. Die, you fool. Almost dead, almost dead. Uh, what health is this car on? Because that's a little bit worrying. 70. Okay. I'm assuming the majority of that came from uh, came from the uh, the rocket launcher let's hope so Farsight, what's he on? 8 you don't really need a burst so let's yeah, let's hunting rifle you to death with a more seeded chance of killing yep, yeah, you're dead now goodbye now, grenade dude. Have got anyone left? Can I put you on Overwatch? Yeah, let's do that. Cool, so now. Uh, I'll try you here. So now, if you pop up to throw a grenade at this thing, we should uh, retaliate, hopefully. Doop doop doop. I'm just a target sitting here. <gasps> it's on 25 health points. This is bad news. Good news is, Stitch is here and ready to fight. And that is that. Now, Stitch, get the shit out. Way to talk it. We need to repair this pronto, otherwise, it's game over. Unfortunately. That's right. You lose this thing, you're fucked. It is the mission over, it counts as a loss which I promised I would stop this let's play when I lose. Losing Brian doesn't count as a loss because we knew he's expendable. So is Jax. Jax is a glass cannon so he's going to die one day but not after or before actually no it's going to be after but not before an epic fight where hopefully he slays lots. How are you doing there Stitch? Uh, oh combat was still open, so it's taking, like, forever. What's his repair skill? 35%. Okay, I think he's bugged out. Let's oh! No, he hasn't. 37 HP. We're going to need you, like, more or less back up to full health, because if there's any more rocket dudes, I don't feel good about it. 
being on that low health failed. But, oh shit, it still takes the, uh, I don't know, the toolkit health, if that's what you want to call it, uh, or usage, to fail an attempt. I should have probably invested, oh dear, this is bad, probably should have invested more into uh, repair people. I'm pretty sure no one else has very good repair. Maybe Brian might have, but guess what happened to him? Mm. I'm not liking this, guys. My car is very, very injured. We may have to go in on foot so we don't fail the mission. Isn't that first time? Wow, so I only got one heal on the vehicle from that entire toolkit. And the noisy, noisy fucking car really annoys me, just so you know. Hence why I got everyone out. Right, now. We lost a guy over this, and we got a rocket launcher. I don't know if it's a good trade, but it's definitely better than just losing a guy and getting nothing. That's right, I'm a half full kind of guy. I mean, imagine if it was a mine that killed him, for example. Or, I don't know, maybe just like had a friggin' aneurysm, died on the spot. You wouldn't get anything then. Just get a guy with an aneurysm as a corpse. I think... <sighs> probably best leave the, the friggin' car here. I don't want to, but... The car is like losing Haxi at the moment. Um, oh, you're out of shorty shells, are you? Oh, of course! I've got freaking Luke Bryan! The dead Bryan that uh, died so honourably being a moving target for the rocket launcher. And these 100 shotgun shells. Maybe that's why you died, Bryan. You're freaking greedy. What's your small guns like? We might give you a shotty. His small gun's good. Let's give him a shotty. Uh, stitch. Where's your spare shotty? Here it is. Stein. We will give you... Not quite as many as Stitch, but a decent amount. So when you are in there, in the enemy's face, you give them what for. Right, team. Um, let's run around spackily for a bit and someone press the switch. Right, now let's play close attention to this map as we don't want any of these. A civilian? Yeah, baby! Is it Austin Powers? Because only Austin Powers is that, I'm sure of it. In fact, let's have a bit of a sneak. Oh, cannot sneak. Maybe this will like confuse them. Only looks like there's two guys. Oh, look at this dude. Far sight. Can't see him. Haxi can't see him. Stitch can't see him. Jax only has 23%. Stein only has 30. This means that hopefully, if I get you over here, you can have two shots on him. This is incorrect. I have lockpicks out. There we go, 67 percent. Cool, how much did that do? Did that knock him over? Critically hit, yeah, 11 points. Happy with that. What about you, Hexy? Can you do it? 80 percent, I like that. What is your. Yeah, it's going to have to be a hunting rifle battle, unfortunately. What? I feel robbed. Um, as I was saying, hopefully, his. Firing is going to be a bit awful. I won't really be able to get too much uh, too much damage on us guys. But even more hopeful that happens. That we you know we kill him before he even gets a shot on us. Which happened. Um cool. Stitch, you might as well uh I know. I was gonna loot him, but then I just realised. Uh, I don't... I can't tell if that's... Ooh! Stitch just took two burst shots. He's pretty hardy. Uh, let's have a shot at you. Slow our son of a bitch. Ooh, that's not very nice, is it? Hmm... Stitch. 
ditch you need to heal up, dude. Yeah, I think this is a good time to use that. Damn it, I hate it when I get surprised by enemies. Pretty healed. Awesome. Right, now. Sneaking. Who's good at it? No one specifically apart from Farsight and Haxi. Haxi is a bit of a weird one because if he sneaks in there and friggin has to initiate on them. Okay, that's good. We've used their uh Huge what's it? AK, AK. You count as being closer, but then again you're taking cover. Tough, cool. You're easy to hit, let's go for you. Ah. Uh. Okay, might as well take cover. I say take cover, you're just kneeling in the middle of the fucking street. But, let's, uh. So you've got metal armor. Let's give them another target to shoot at. Specifically, him and other type of shooter. Eighty-four percent, and then fifty-six. Oh, tough! Because if I hit him with that, it should do a lot more than the hunting rifle. Decisions. What would Haxi do? I think in this situation, it's AK versus AK, and they're both pretty lethal. Let's go for it. Did it pay off? 20 points of damage. Yes, it did. Um, Mr. Glass Cannon. Can you finish him? If you move there. Then you've got a shot on him. And I would look at him if I had far sight movement left, but I can't, so I just have to, you know, just take that death, you know. Oh, I hate that. It's just going to remind me now every time that friggin' Brian died. Every time I, uh. Can you move here? Let's give it a go. No, he can't. So I think he's just a sitting duck now. Hello, Stein. Stein, run this way. Try and be another target. So you're harder than Farsight. Haxi, that's good. He's got metal armor. He can take a little bit of a beating. Haxi, are you gonna. Are you gonna take that? I, I heard that you don't actually take that sort of bullshit. Up that uh, AP calculation, but he's only on 19, so we've uh, we've wrapped this one up. Lucky shot. It's all cold calculations, my friend. Cold mistakes as well along the way. Uh, I'm still investigating. Slash, I forgot to investigate that button that makes everyone reload at the same time. And. Farsight's being super cool. Is that a guitar? I can't pick it up, unfortunately. Nom nom nom. So you've all got AKs. I think they're still worth a fair bit. I don't know if you get like a decreased value for stuff when you just keep selling it. But the same thing. But uh, I'm going to take them regardless as they, they don't seem to take a much uh, carry weight. Alright, stand up far sight, you look ridiculous. Ha ha ha, right, we know there's some red dots here. We know there's some dude here. Screw you and all your AKs. They really hurt when you burst them. I could like just run past this. Nothing. About past here. Behind oh, that actually made me jump. What have you got then? M9FS Barrera. That's so what we're going to do to you. Is we're going to burst at you. And then we're going to run this way. You guys move in. And then end turn. Yes, you're still a corpse. Blown to bits. So we've had Trevor got melted into a puddle of gloop and we've had Brian who got uh, blown to bits by a rocket launcher sad news as it is this was the, the long you know the long game plan we didn't want 
these three specifically dying. Stein is now an investment as well. I'm not going to be too sad if he does die because he's still just a newbie, but he's got some pretty good beginning stats that I'd like to keep him. This is why we get Stein as the bait next though. It makes sense. Stein, you take the bullshit. Jax, your glass cannon ways defeat the threat. It's, it's almost textbook. I mean, I don't know how else to explain it. Yes, that's me being cocky and arrogant. Um, until something goes wrong, then I'll be a slivering mess. Mind you, Brian went pretty wrong. I think I held it together. I mean, I was crying inside. I'll give you an AK. Why not? Was there anything decent here? An ice chest. Ice in the wasteland. You'd be lucky. Hmm. Molotov cocktails. Toolkit. That is was well worth it. Even though... Um... Who'd you flick? Stitch failed pretty hard repairing that vehicle. But, you know, we assessed the situation and now we're doing it on foot, so it's not a problem. We don't. In fact, I could go back and. Yes, yes, I will. Executive decision has been made. Let's repair this vehicle and perhaps try and continue inside the vehicle rather than sacrificing people like Brian. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Where are you, toolkit? Didn't he not pick it up? Oh, Haxi did. Okay, come down here, Haxi. Ah, look at him showing off all his metal armor. And we're going to give that to Stitch. Stitch is going to put that in here. And we're going to use it on that. Fast is going to look at the health. And we're going to see what happens. 5 HP, well done Stitch. Does he get XP for that? Yes he does, that's pretty awesome. Let's try again. We're just going to keep using them until they run out. Or until it's on 180 health again. Yep, I expected at least one fail, and there it is. Come yeah, on Stitch, we all believe in you. Twirl those wrists. Yeah! We've got two more repairs than this. If he gets them both, we'll pretty much be on... I think, yeah, we'll overkill it a little bit, actually. We'll be on full health. But... Oh. What do you think, guys? Place your bets now. We believe in you, Stitch. Do not fail. Oh, he failed. But, you know what? 159 is nothing to be ashamed of. You got that uh you got this vehicle back onto a decent amount of health stitch. Be proud of yourself. In the process, driving like a complete wanker. Uh, and got yourself some experience. Not by driving like a wanker, may I add. Right, so we got a civilian up here. They're gonna be hostile, they're red. We're gonna just walk up there. Because have them damage the car after we just went through. They're going to throw rocks or some bullshit at me, aren't they? They're going to be some sort of pathetic threat. Come on, what are you going to do? Oh, that's not pathetic. I'm going to have... A, I'm not going to lie, I'm going to have a little bit of joy gunning these guys down. Marsite, get out of the way of Stitch. You know he's a dangerous fucker. Take one of the back dudes out. 41, 41. Basic kick, rock, Molotov. Rock, dart, Molotov. Jax, do the rest please. Almost. Haxi, would you... You can't. No! Oh, way to go, Haxi. Misclick your way to victory. You've 
you got dark. Not much to worry about, but I still will kill you. Oh, I had a nice death. We can kill this bitch, I can sense it. We just need to get in view of her. Oh, that lied to me. Look at that big, huge lie. Uh, I'll go for this dude. Might get a double hit. Hmm. Don't quite know how that happened. Don't throw the Molotov. Please don't throw the Molotov. Don't do it. Oh, look at him. Listen to me. Haxi, would you like to have some fun? Actually, yes, Haxi. Haxi would like to have some fun. Oh! Oh! No! He's just going to misclick again! For fuck's sake! Twice in a row! What's your health? Twelve. You need to go down. Okay, now we can relax a little bit. We just don't have people trying to blow us up. Oh, Jack, so you're just like the best sniper ever. You can see both of them, so we might as well single you. Nice. That's a pretty good uh, turn, I think. No, not the rocks. Anything but the rocks. 21. What we'll do is we'll get Stein to have a little pick at him. He just Matrix dodges his way to fucking victory. Yeah, we'll get fast up to finish him off. I don't know if... Uh, I was going to say, I don't know if that... Uh, if XP works that way. What happened to your gun? I swear he gave you an AK. Ooh, my name's Stitch. I can't see him. Here we go. Oh, you pathetic piece of patheticness. Right, you run over here. Can you see him? No. How about one more step? No. Nope. How about one more step? Hmm. Try my patience, Mr. Haxi. Try my patience indeed. This could be the biscuit? Yep. The biscuit was taken, and now it says I can hit him. I think it's a damn lie. Why can't you see him, Mr. Jax? Explain yourself. Is it because you're kneeling down? Yes, it is. Now, that should be pretty perfect for Farsight to finish her off. <sighs> Do you see that, guys? Do you see that one point that Jax left him on? That is for Farsight and Farsight only. Again, I don't remember the details. If it's a kill based XP system or a group XP system based on the fights that you uh, participate in. I'm going to enjoy this nonetheless. Die, civilian. Right. Get fucking prepared. It's going to be a wild looting party of... You little druggy. I was going to say of rocks, but... Artemis is pretty valuable, so I'm not too uh, disappointed with that one. Stitch, you get your sexy shotgun out, and you have a look inside. Uh, is there a door that's not... A little bit of a bitch to get to. Maybe there's one in the front one, I just didn't see it. No. Nope, the door is indeed a bitch. Okay, so, what we're going to do is we're going to drive this vehicle up to the gate, and we're going to end the episode there. So far, I'd say it's been a bit of a success. Uh, we did lose a dude, but it was a dude that we intended to lose in the long run. So, not so much of a big deal. Um, thank you for watching, guys. Um, this has been episode 16 of Let's Play Fallout Tactics with me, Hexy Rage. Next episode, more gates, more randomness uh, with getting ambushed and such. And we'll just see how I end up with it, I suppose. Um, this is where we want to be. We want to be on the green. You know, the grass is always greener on the green green. Cool. Uh, subscribe, like, and all the rest of that jazz that YouTubers do. Uh, take care, and I will see you in the next episode.